The Stephen A. Cohen Clinic took home a big award on Tuesday from Duke University, which will help create the next wave of military mental health experts in Alaska. Georgina Fernandez tells us how in this week's Inside the Gates. It's a step forward for military mental health in Alaska. This partnership with Duke and this award means that we're able to sustain a program that brings more services to the state of Alaska's military and veteran population. The Stephen A. Cohen Military Family Clinic was awarded the 2222 Preceptor of the Year Award by Duke University. They recognized us as, as the site of the year for last year for the internship opportunities they provide to Duke University students. They're not only getting to see active duty individuals and reservists, they're getting to see families, they're getting to see children. They're get Mary Beth Goodman with the clinic says this means they'll be able to gain more interns down the road. We're also gaining some great resources and increasing our staff and the people who serve this community. Whose education will have a strong focus on military mental health a needed area of focus across the U.S. We need individuals who are providing services to be culturally competent in the arenas that these families and these service members and these retirees go through. The program has already proven to be impactful. The two interns who were with us during this inaugural year where we, where we achieved this Preceptor of the Year award from, they're actually coming on board to be full-time staff with us. Receiving this award, this Goodman says, will ensure the, the clinic will be able to continue the program down the road. And so if we can bring this experience to individuals during their educational journey, we can excite and hopefully motivate more people to really want to take on and practice in this population. Growing the next generation of military mental health experts and creating a healthier Alaskan military community. Inside the Gates, Georgina Fernandez, Alaska's News Source. And if you enjoy stories about.